there's something we're not being told about our upcoming elections in the UK. Our two major parties have been compromised and are undemocratically transitioning us away from shareholder capitalism to another political system. This short story begins with Klaus Schwab, the executive chairman of the World Economic Forum. We are working closely together with governments from around the world, including all G20 countries. His exclusive elite members, called stakeholders, include the heads of all G20 countries, from the US and UK to communist countries like China. What we are very proud of now is the young generation like uh, Prime Minister Trudeau that we penetrate the cabinets. After penetrating our cabinets, Schwab and his stakeholders have enacted a 10-year transition to another political system, which Schwab designed. I pioneered the stakeholder concept. Called stakeholder capitalism. Stakeholder capitalism is finally becoming mainstream. This single global authoritarian system provides the stakeholders unprecedented control over our companies and lives. The Chinese model is certainly a very attractive model for quite a number of countries. Promoted on the cover of Klaus Schwab's book, Stakeholder Capitalism's slogan is propagated by the heads of all G20 countries and other powerful stakeholders. People and planet, people and planet. In the UK, Prime Minister and stakeholder Rishi Sunak has already made stakeholder capitalism's credit score mandatory for large companies. We're announcing the UK's intention to mandate climate disclosures. Sunak's opposition, Keir Starmer, is also a World Economic Forum stakeholder. It doesn't matter which party we vote for, both have a stakeholder responsibility in accelerating the transition to stakeholder capitalism by enacting its Marxist and tyrannical policies. This is the best time for leaders to work jointly for the world to become more inclusive, more sustainable. If you've wondered what's causing these strange events, it's because we're witnessing a cultural revolution, a social movement manufactured by tyrants. Create a stronger inclusiveness. To drive a shift from the bottom up to a more inclusive political system. You have been promoting the stakeholder concept. The era will be inclusive for them. Other powerful UK stakeholders include Boris Johnson, Matt Hancock and Sadiq Khan as well as the head of the BBC and our media regulator, Ofcom. They've been indoctrinating us to believe narratives about them acquiring totalitarian authority are dangerous right-wing conspiracy theories. What can you do if someone you know has fallen down the conspiracy theory rabbit hole? As well as manipulating us with propaganda, the stakeholders have been cancelling and censoring anyone who shares the truth. Under new online safety laws, conversation and discourse is being shut down. To discover how stakeholder capitalism works, Schwab's full plan for transitioning us and what we can do about it, watch my feature documentary series, Stakeholder Communism, for free at yellow.forum.